Hello, hello, what's up guys? Gets here for another Nino Kuni Cross Worlds update. And today we have the update schedule notice for Wednesday, March 8th. So this will be the changes that are coming in. So let's check it out. Okay, first up, update schedule. We still don't know when it will end, but it's the usual time. I think this is still 2 p.m. or 1 p.m. each time. Okay, update details, episode, fated challenge cards, second update. So we're going to get our hard and challenge mode and of course episode shop renewal which means we're going to have new stuff in the shop for the episode so uh, i'm not sure how the challenge mode would work especially with the fated cards and stuff but we will see right and of course and the field boss season 4 mecha Ragon. so corrupted mecha Ragon is gonna go away so let's check out this notes over here so field boss season 4 mecha Ragon ending schedule notice okay so it's going to end Af right after the maintenance okay so there are some things here that you might want to check on so the dish will now be gone as well it will be removed and your ingredients will be turned into gold pouches so any food ingredients that you were able to get from the drops will be turned into gold it's not much but oh well right and then medals or the crafts over here yeah the, the medal crafting you will no longer have them as well. So medals 1 to 3 will become 1,000 gold each. And this is good, right? The medal 4s will become Regent Chasers, which is okay. It's fine. You can smelt them or salvage them for stones, which is okay. And then pages. So Darkness Surge, you will no longer be able to get Darkness Surge. I never got mine, so oh well. <laughs> so it's 1,000 gold each. Okay, and then costume. Metal yarn will turn into seven magic yarns. Shop Mecha Ragon Exchange Shop. So the exchange shop will also be removed, of course. And your tokens will be changed into 100k gold. So if you haven't used use your token yet, I think it's still worth it to use this one. Uh, I think this one was only available for paying players anyway. So yeah, use them before they get removed. Okay. Related info will be changed or removed. Main main boss Mecha Ragon. Okay, so corruption is no longer there. So it's going to be a normal Mecha Ragon now. And then removal of season rewards. The dish will be removed as well. Crafting. Okay. So crafting for Regent Chaser and Heaven's Judgment will be removed as well. Darkness Surge skill will be removed. Or the source will now be removed. Costume, of course, you can no longer craft it as well. So if you were not able to craft it, then oh well, <laughs> right? I wasn't good anyway, <laughs> coming from someone who doesn't do field bosses. But yeah, if you're uh, trying to get the costume, then this is your last chance until tomorrow, actually. So yeah, and then shop closure, of course. Okay, so see you in field boss season 5. Okay, so with the new field boss season 5, we now have Stelia. So it looks like we're moving downwards from Mecha Ragon down to stelia now and then of course increase boss difficulty so hopefully this will now remove the mecha start meta syrup meta but we will see right um i'm not sure if people will be transferring over to stelia first but hopefully every everyone just go ahead and start with um sb right the silver beard because well we're going we're going to get adjustments so it will take a bit longer now to kill the bosses but i hope it's a significant enough um, buff to all the bosses so that it will not take us two to three minutes finishing our field boss dailies. Okay, and then we have a new field boss, Blue Goddess statue. I'm assuming this one will be in Bodily Archives. No? So if it's gonna be there, it's going to be really, really good. We'll have more channels, especially for gold farming areas. Right, it's always so packed in gold areas. So this is a good update to increase the channels. Okay. But of course, with a new update, we're going to reset all the channels. So hopefully, there's still a lot more active players after the merge. So we will see how much channels we have left on the next update. Okay. Temple Arena Balance adjust Adjustment. So we need more, more details on what this means. Right? Temple Arena Balance Adjustment. What does that mean? Is it a matchmaking thing, rewards thing, or whatever? We have no idea, so... We'll wait for the updates and then end of Twisted Borders Season 2. So if you have not done your uh, Twisted Borders yet, do them now. You get diamonds for it, okay? So diamonds and some dolls as well. But I think diamonds is the more 
compelling rewards from that one. New costumes. Okay, Midnight Hunter outfit or hat. I don't have any visuals for this one, so we just have to wait for it, right? And then Star Starry Night hat, uh, Milky Way glasses, and Shooting Star. So this one are going to be the rewards from the challenge, right? Episode challenge dungeon. Okay, new events. Join the Heagle D treasure hunt, treasure hunt again. Cards clear event and surprise field boss conquest event. So of course, new field boss season, new field boss stuff. End of sale, um, power up familiars, toy treasure chest bundle, and uncommon pet summon bundle. Okay, then new packages and new bug fix, er, and then bug fixes. Okay, so that's pretty much it for the updates that are coming in. So it's not a huge one, right? It's not going to be a very, very huge update. So there's not much to prepare. So yeah, um, I don't think there's much to this one. Uh, I think it's just very exciting that we're going to have more channels for Bodily Archive. Hopefully this is, yeah, there's no other place that they can put a new boss, right? It's just going to be Bodily Archive. So just means more areas to form because it's really really getting super crowded especially for us it's like three cha three channels but the archive so it's not good and right? it's not good so hopefully this will increase it to at least seven eight so that a lot more people will be able to farm gold gold especially gold i think is the most uh farmed resource in the non-chaos field areas right so yeah um, I think that's pretty much it. I'm pretty much excited for the Temple Arena balance adjustment here as well. Hopefully, this is good news. Right? Hopefully, this is good news. So, this will be the update for March 8th. So, we will not be seeing anything for the next two weeks update yet. So, after March 8th, we have March 22. So, I'm assuming March 22 will have the updates that we discussed earlier on on the dev notes. Right, so the dev note stuff will be discussed or will be updated hopefully March 22. But I think, yeah, it would be March 22 because that's also by the time when the uh, 300 day celebration would also be most likely up. So looking forward to that. But for now, this is all we have. This is all that we get for the next patch. So it's not a huge patch. So hopefully maintenance does not extend as far as 7 6 7 p.m because we want to try the new field boss right so yeah hopefully that does uh, extensions do not happen because this is not a huge update right so yeah of course we're going to check it out right away during our streams which the tv slash kids gg uh, will be live as soon as the update ends okay or the maintenance has ended all right so see you guys there and that's it for me today let me know your thoughts in the comments below and see you again next time Bye bye